What do we got? Conflict. And we've got conflict. That's unusual. Hardly ever happens. I don't know, if we can keep holding the line, we might just win, just on sheer morale. Of holding the line. Which I think was realistic, imagine, if you imagine, like, uh, imagine Scandinavians that, holding off, like, <laughs> the Roman army for, like, uh, not Roman, the uh, <laughs> Soviet army. <laughs> like, for like, uh, I can totally imagine that to be. <laughs> yeah, I think they could probably handle the Romans if they had these tanks. All right, I put a, a guy here and a guy here. Are you gonna hold? I'll hold in you and try and pros push into Ossus, and that's uh, yeah. my plan. Sounds like a plan. That way, at least we can uh, get some more points. Oh, I've still got the uh, the, the cheap depot guys that can run into the forest. Yeah, the cheapos. Yeah, cheapo horde. Might try that actually. Might try a, a back attack. To attack them from the rear. Mm-hmm. That's like some sort of elite strategy. I doubt NATO would have pulled off something like that. There'd just been loads of bickering between the Americans and Europeans. Yeah, I was about to say the amount of coordination that would have required, it's just it's not their style. Yeah. <coughs> NATO would be all about the like utter individualism yeah. of the nations. We we're gonna do this, and you were gonna do this. <laughs> Fuck's sake, lads. Things will be like beneath their national pride to do. Yeah. Hopefully, I can hold Foxtrot. I guess I should no, just I devote all the points to that because I can't actually reinforce it. I've only got the really bad tanks, though. Might be an issue. Well, they're bad, but they do have eight frontal armor, which isn't utterly terrible. Yeah, but it's not going to stand up to a T80, is it? Oh no! So it's immediately going to die to anything that fires at it. <laughs> that's that's reassuring, lads. It might take one hit. Oh dear. Might be lucky and it might take one hit. I like long range glancing. Yeah. Alright, I think that's pretty much everything I can. I imagine answer. the problem is more that it can actually damage them. Oh, yeah, but uh, that, that, its job isn't to damage them, its job is to just sit there and, and draw the Tank fire it. whilst you get. Awesome. Yeah, it's literally. Be a tank. Literally, be a tank. If we can get all these men into the into the woods, I know that as soon as it starts, they'll just they'll just put this bang 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 bang. It's all the <laughs> T80s on the front line. Fire. <laughs> fire targets and fire. Yeah. Here we go. You got a forest there, though. You got a chance. So we won't immediately swarm with planes. That was that was one concern I had. Because they had like complete air superiority, as usual. Yeah. 
Basically, apart from the Americans, no one has decent AA. Would you want it any other way? I guess not. I guess the G the German AA is good as well. French German one, but the British and uh, everyone else AA is not good. Oh, stuck in the mud. Oh, that's bad timing. Go, 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 lads, go, go, go. Here we go. I'm watching your uh, assault. You can see an enemy vehicle. Oh, he's dead. You can see their forward operating base. Oh gosh, yeah. Now's your chance. To earn like honour and glory eternal. Oh look, you're, you're actually getting all the way in, and they're not stopping you. That's no, just classic. Oh, they're running. They've sensed you. Didn't hit the UAV, of course. Yeah. Of course. Standard. Just there, though. I can see it. Should I call the Vigan on it? What do you think of their ace defense? I think I might try and get some tanks around the back instead. Okay. So they can fire from where they are now or something? Oh, you're sneaking some ATGM around the back. That is like uh, what the fuck are these guys doing? You're sending in some transport vehicles into melee. That's that's classic though. Multiplayer strategy to see where the enemy is. Got that the, per uh, perfect jet strike there. You got it, well done. They're coming in with men behind you, though. Excluding, like, uh, uh, three TATs. I've got some stuff, so... And Estrella, so you can't send in planes. I'm not using planes. They've got a book there as well, actually. They've got enough AA that we can't really do much. Have you seen their force uh, behind your lines? I have. What do you reckon? You gonna take it out? I can take it out. Oh, that's what we like to hear. Well, they called in some artillery, lads. Well, oh, more T-80s in the north. Oh, they got T-80Bs. 
Yeah, they've got TADBVs behind you as well. Let's drive. I might be able to capture those uh, Urals if I move faster. Though. Yes. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. <laughs> You're escaping with those yells, that's classic. Can special forces take Modestelsky? About to find out. No, they cannot. Uh, no, not, not 40 of them, no, I don't think. They're not even worth 10 to 1. That's, that's just pointless, Lance. Alright. Some crappy infantry it is. Did just get a T80 there. Well done. Pity we have no artillery. It's a bit unbalanced. You've got the computer completely outwitted in this uh, town on this map, though. I think, yeah, I have kind of. Oh, yeah, completely over overpowered him. Looks like they might be coming down the road, though. Yeah, yeah. They might close you here, Han. They may possibly be able to outwit me here, unless I can get the FOB, but then... What, what about back behind your lines where they're rolling in? About How's to kill that? your ATGM. Pretty sure... Yeah. I'm sure I can... do some stuff over to help. They have three T-80s back there as well, though, remember. Yeah, there we go. Well done. Well, that was actually quite um, <laughs> a brutal raping for them. We only yeah. lost like 200 points. I barely had to fight in that, yeah. That's, that was one where men was just... Men were just... Overwhelming. Overwhelming. Yeah, there's no point in those high-tech units. You just want a load of infantry. Hmm. We're going to drive them all the way back to Russia at this rate. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> then, we, then it comes to this battle. Obviously they've already conquered Germany, so... Oh yeah, <laughs> just realised that what that means. Oh, I guess we can, I guess we better do it. This will be a desperate last stand by the looks of it. Didn't we attack with the, uh, with the other unit? I guess they haven't made it there yet. Yeah, there'll be another battle for oh that, if we hold these sectors. Oh dear. I think we have to hold Echo and Aarhus, probably. Maybe forget Copenhagen, what do you think? Because last time we had defended both, but we took extremely heavy losses in Copenhagen. Copenhagen seems like the best one to defend. Alright. Because it's a wide open terrain for them to get there. Okay, take take Copenhagen then. Are you going to def defend Aarhus and Echo? Both of them. I can defend Aarhus, maybe. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Depending on what units we have. We haven't got a great deal to actually fight them with. <laughs> oh no, we have nothing. That's jokes. I guess it's best just to spread some infantry around and hope they roll into it. 
The inventory's really expensive, though. Because of the vehicles. Ah, uh, the vehicles are expensive. They found like the most pricey ones available. Oh, there goes all my deployment points, lads. That's that's the defence I'm going with. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah, I don't know how we're going to hold this, to be honest. Your uh, confidence is uh, overwhelming. Overwhelming. Thanks. <laughs> go for firepower. Oh, I'll go for like number of things shooting rather than actual. AP fa power 14, that's not too bad. Guess I should probably get a recon as well. I'm here in so much trouble. 15 points. Points, lads. A lack of much serious AA is probably going to be a problem as well. Or any. We have some uh, LVR uh, BVs. You realise they're just going to spawn right, right on the road, like here or something. I'm assuming. I'm assuming they're all going to spawn there, yeah. <laughs> so the open plane is probably not going to be hugely helpful. Nah, it could be, could be pretty much useless. Oh well, let's do it. Okay. Ball. Do they happen to be exactly where you thought they would be? <laughs> they're exactly where you put the crosshair. The AI is uh, not predictable at all, lads. They seem to be falling back though, rather than uh, charging forwards. There's like a column of vehicles in the background, obviously approaching. kills doing it. Will you get about a thousand kills? Because that's probably about what we need. That would be just be ideal if we could do that. <laughs> Gonna lose that forward operating base as well. Have you there? Mm. I seem to hit this. Uh... Oh yeah, it's got it. Twenty-five points. Boom. I guess you could try and retreat your command to the south when their hordes charge through. Yeah. There's no harm in trying, lads.
Uh, they destroyed the FMB. Oh well, at least they won't have it. Only T fifty fives actually. Yeah, I don't think they have the heaviest tanks, but the problem is we don't really have any tanks either. And no ATGM apart from the vehicle. Those T fifty fives are insanely good. They are pretty good. And annoyingly they seem to be able to spot me. It might be ideal to pull back into into full cover, I suppose. But that just means we get annihilated. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. <laughs> For those tanks, the war is over, lads. For you, so far, it's over. God, this wipeout is just so so devastating. Not over yet. Well, they only have to score like half the points of us, so I'm about equal. You try to take them with that one tank. That's classic. Oh bloody hell, how accurate the artillery is. Accurate, that's accurate. Yeah, I thought we were in trouble in this one. It's okay, I'm sure our second army will be able to win. I lost jet. Hopefully that's not uh, cluster bombs. Ah, oh, it's just bombs. Good. I love the way you just keep rolling in the tanks, though. You've got utter faith. Alright. Someone has to. Look at that. Wiping them out. Just send more men into, into Death Valley, lads. I did that classic thing where I called things on when they came in through the wrong entrance. <laughs> and they just sort of start <laughs> running like, straight towards the enemy. Well, there's no hope of making it through now. I'm looking more T-55s for you to kill out. Yeah. If I can get away. Do with a bit more recon, I guess. Oh, they're winning now, Alan. It all, it all went wrong.
don't seem to wish to actually move in, which is uh, perfect for me. Keep calling stuff in if they're not going to... Sounds like a plan. It's okay, I'm, I'm, I'm intimidating them. Yeah. You are. I mean, obviously their morale is like almost broken now. Soon you'll be able to charge your infantry forwards. What infantry? Are you all out of infantry? Oh. No, just, oh, I haven't brought any on. Alright, I think I'll send my 20 men into that horde then. <laughs> Probably best if you, if you don't. If it's <laughs> all the same to you. <laughs> You don't appreciate my assistance in your in your fight. Feel like I'm trying to steal some of your glory. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I probably am. Wow, you don't get much ammo with these. Uh... No, you get like no ammo, I and mean, they don't even seem to do that much damage. I like watching the missile come in, wondering what it's actually going for. Yeah, oh, I, I knew what it was. Oh, we don't all know everything, Alan. I knew what it was going for. We got, oh, we didn't get that. We got two hits on it, but... They're basically unkillable. What anti-air they have? I guess they don't want to charge into your close-range fire. Radar missiles. But still, yeah, basically have anti-airplanes. Oh no, we got. They they're got halfway to winning. Oh. Maybe they're waiting for you to bring on uh, 600 points worth of units. Oh yeah, sending in some planes. Okay, now now's the time to do that. It's dead. It's dead. Oh, elite Alan. I don't know how you did it. Didn't, didn't actually kill anything. But you, so, you did yeah. manage to fly in and fly out, so we can count that as a win. By our standards. Looks like they're retreating. Yeah, they're just terrified of your concentrated artillery fire. I think it's because I've got a helicopter around the back, because they've suddenly started firing artillery at my helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> of course. They, they think your main attack's coming there. Well, any delay is uh, only serves to help us, so... It's true. If I can get the men into the... Uh, <laughs> into their spawning in position. In, into the mountains. No, they're only recon. <laughs> the spawning in position. <laughs> what, what do you call it? Just, just the thought of sending rather weak men against everything that they can potentially do. <laughs> what do you mean weak men? These are like, uh, you know, proud Scandinavian uh, super warriors. Super warriors. <laughs> they have Carl Gustav uh, guns. Oh, we got a few of their guys that time. Yeah, we did actually, yeah. Well, let's see if I can... I guess next I'll try and intimidate their helicopter. If I can get a lock on it. 
I might be able to get the, the Strella. I might be able to get a sack loss on it. Really? Oh dear. I guess I'll yes. intimidate, I'll intimidate the helicopter for now. Oh no, I, tr I could try using the, the Vigan on it, of course. <laughs> yeah, send in that 115 point uh, plane. Let's do it. Where we know yeah, they have yeah, a Strella. Yeah. It's probably going to get hit by my artillery. Alright, time to run away. You got one, you got one missile off. <laughs> and th that can't shoot down a helicopter apparently, being hit by a missile. They didn't even do half damage to it. <laughs> this game and like, uh, the nerfing of some like, plane Jeez. properties. I've got like, two hits! What? <laughs> oh, you got it, you got it! Uh, don't think so. I think it got away. Uh -oh. Got MiG-17 coming in. See, it's still there. It's still there. <laughs> Them sending in all their guys to take out your men behind their lines. It's just classic. Oh, they got the helicopter. I didn't notice. Uh oh, they got one BMP. <laughs> that doesn't sound so terrifying. Oh no, there's way more than that! <laughs> oh, here comes a vegan. On a suicide mission. It's good shots there. Good shots, lads. Good shots, lads. Did you get one there? Got a couple there, actually, I think. Wow, how many vegans do you have? You're incredibly wealthy. Who's winning now, eh? You, Alan. You're winning. Well done. It's like your finest hour. <clears throat> but we don't have any in into air there. Oh, here comes their tank horde. Actually, it doesn't look like they have anti air. Oh no, a little bit of anti air there. They seem to be uh, mortaring their own stuff. Oh no, that's you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, them. Mortaring their own stuff. Quite cool that they uh, tried a different, different tactic there. Yeah. Though they probably could have just charged straight in. No problem. But they didn't know that. I guess. So we know that they do know that? Like the way they knew that your recon was back there? Oh, I guess so, yeah. <laughs> Let's see what we can see. Oh, they've got some stuff around the back. I guess they're all making a run for it. Quite a lot of stuff around the back, actually. Oh shit, Migs, Migs, Migs. Oh well, our Vigs are dead. They're lucky they flew in at like an oblique angle. Your confidence is quite high. I noticed you didn't actually evac those two uh, Vigans. They're just flying in circles. Um. I used them to attack out one of the MiGs. Oh wow, that's like some sort of elite strategy. Eva, Eva, Eva. Look at that one going in. With that MiG right behind it. Ah, uh, it's evacking. <sighs> oh look, this is where their men have gone. From that offensive earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! 
They really have. They really have, lads. Well, actually, it's not their men, it's just a, a load of other tanks. So if I run up onto the cliffs again, they won't be able to get They them. look like the same tanks, though, that they uh, sent in the, in the other offensive well, as it drew back. Yeah, they undoubtedly are. I'm sending some reinforcing fire to slow them down. Ah. Oh. My units are coming in the wrong place, as usual. There's a lot of T-55s that we can we can take out there. If we had the power. If only we could actually hit with the sodding electrical optical missiles. They are pretty inaccurate, I've noticed. There's probably some trick to getting them to hit, though. Getting a few points. Seems to be just driving all that stuff into that one location. And then we could just bombard that location, yeah. That's the strategy. I remember they're just trying to get critical mass until they, uh, they yeah. launch and destroy Yeah, I guess the they are trying to build up. Would have helped if they hadn't sent like that entire horde back to deal with your recon, though. It seems like you've learned right. exactly how to play the computer's uh, extreme idiocy. Yeah. <laughs> the way we have two recon helicopters just watching them. Oh, we won. Oh, no, oh. we've run out of time. Oh, well. That probably means we lost, but still, it's good effort. <laughs>